All right, good evening, everyone. Welcome to Creek Bullets TV. I'm Alan Haley. We are live at the middle school here in Clinch County where the Clinch County Panthers are hosting the Turner County Titans for the boys' middle school final four. The winner will advance to the championship. And we already have a technical foul because of Jersey's issue, I think. Uh, you cannot have the number six, seven, eight or nine it has to be a uh, single digit numbers or it's a tick one point number two malik will make it so the panthers lead one to nothing and we'll get possession of the ball right here to start the game miss t i got my buddy daniel over here helping me we're shooting it Live here, it's Sophia over here drinking a cocoa, eating popcorn. <laughs> All right, here we go. Number 11 for the Panthers, Posley with the ball. It'll take me a minute to get the name. He'll pass it over to Johnson, back to Posley. He's gonna drive in and kick it out to Malik. Malik will pull up, throws up a 10 footer, he'll miss it. Turner County with the rebound. Here comes number four, that's Sowers down the court. He'll give it up to Bateman, number one. They'll drive in, he'll miss. Here comes Posley back down the court. Pull up 12 footer off the back of the rim. Can't get it to fall. Good rebound by Turner. Long pass. Panthers will take possession of it. That's Johnson with the ball. All the way in and there'll be a foul. It will be a charge on Johnson. So that'll be his first foul. Clinch County one, Turner County nothing. They play six minute quarters. And we have been playing for 29 seconds. All right, Turner County's gonna bring it in. He'll get it in to Bateman. Bateman back over to Rhodes. Panthers in a little press, it looks like. Back to Rhodes. Oh, Rhodes trip. He's gonna keep it, though. Nope, 10 second violation. That'll be a turnover. The Panthers, Panthers will take over. Number 13 will bring it in for the Panthers. That's Prather. He'll give it up to Posley. He'll kick it out to Malik. Good shot. He missed it. That was number five. That was Mingo. Malik with the rebound. He'll get it back to Posley. Back down to Mingo. Mingo. Good pass back door. Off the backboard. Up and in. That's Burns. Shane Burns with the basket. Panthers lead three to nothing now. And that's going to be another turnover by Turner. He took too many steps. So the Panthers will take over again. Here comes Posley bringing it down. Turner playing man to man to see we got a foul and they're gonna call that on number two. That'll be Rhodes, that'll be his first. Posley with the ball. They get it to Malik. Good job, Mingo, turn around. He'll make it fall, that'll make it five to nothing. Panthers jump back in a press. Up. They're gonna have a foul, let's see, they're gonna call that on number 11, that'll be on Posley, that'll be his first foul. Panthers lead five to nothing, 421 to play in the first. Turner finally will get the ball over half court. Lawhorn with the ball now. He'll give it up to Bateman. Bateman looking, he's gonna drive in. He'll pull up at the free throw line. Can't get it to fall. 13 with the rebound. That's Johnson for the Panthers. They had a foul. So the Panthers will keep possession. Posley bringing it down. He'll give it up to Johnson. Johnson all the way to Malik. Malik trying to hit Mingo, couldn't get him. Here comes Turner. Back on the other end. Sears with the ball, he'll give it up to Rhodes. Rhodes back over to Bateman. A long shot off the back of the rim, couldn't get it to go. Panthers with the rebound, here come the Panthers. Posley, long pass over to Johnson, driving in. He'll lose the ball out of bounds. 
Good hustle by Turner to get over there and knock it out. There's Mingo from the free throw line, can't get it to fall. Big rebound in there, and big man number four, Sear, just took it away from one of the Panthers. There's Malik trying to steal it. Good job, number one will kick it out. Long three, tried by Lawhorn, couldn't get it to fall. Turner trying to get their first basket here. Panthers lead five to nothing. There's a shot. Bateman going thought about it. He'll go down low. Can't get it to fall. Posey with the rebound, and he'll throw it away. Coach James Edwards and Zai Willison coach for the Panthers, and Coach Johnson and Coach Temple for Turner County. Coach James has done a great job this year. The Panthers are 10-0 on the year. Haven't lost a game. There's a jumper, can't get it to fall. Number 12, that's number 13 with the rebound. They go trying to hit Mingo down low, can't get it. Good job by number four for Turner, that's Sears. He'll steal it, he gives it up to King, back to Sears now. Sears will hand it off to Bateman. Now they'll set a play up. Panthers lead five to nothing halfway through the first. Got it inside, good move, number two. He had a shot, couldn't get it to fall. Tried to get his own rebound, but he stepped out of bounds. Turner's in a little trap defense now. Malik with the ball, he's gonna try to get it over. Good job, number four. For Turner, Sears tipped it. Sears with the ball now, here comes Turner. He's going to drive. He'll shoot from the free throw line and got it to fall. Turner's on the board now. Five to two. Panthers lead. Malik with the ball. He'll lose it. There's going to be a foul on number 13. That's Johnson. That'll be his second. I'll tell you what. Both teams at Clinch County High School and Turner County High School, their future is bright. So there's some talent out here playing middle school basketball. Lawhorn with the ball, he'll give it up. Now he'll give it up to Bateman. Bateman's gonna drive in, throw it up. They said he traveled, so that'll be a turnover. Johnson will bring it in for the Panthers. They'll give it up to Posey, back to Johnson, wasn't ready for it. Just a mental mistake. Not a Silly turnover by the Panthers. We're just starting. There's a long three. Boom! Got it to fall. Good shot there by number one, Bateman. Five to five. We're all tied up now. We got a foul on number four. That's Sears. That'll be his first for Turner. Johnson will bring it in for the Panthers now. He'll give it to Posley. Five to five, 125 to play in the first. Panthers get it to Burns. Burns is gonna pull up off the backboard, can't get it. Good defensive rebound in there by Turner, and that's number four at Sears. Getting up high, snatching that ball out of the air. Sears, long three, can't get it to go. Good rebound in there by Johnson for the Panthers. Long pass to Malik. Malik will pull up just inside the free throw, off the backboard, got it to fall. Malik with three points tonight. He'll put the Panthers back on top, seven to five. Good steal there by number 13, Johnson. Posley with the ball, he'll kick it back to Malik. Long three, can't get it to go. Big rebound down low, can't get it. Panthers back in two. Turner had the rebound finally, but he traveled, so the Panthers will take the possession back over. We got a sub coming in now, 22 for the Panthers. That Burns will take a break. And Simon will come in for the Panthers, number three. Posey with the ball, he'll shoot just inside the three, can't get it, good. Rebound again by number 23 for the Panthers. That's Miller. Turn around, he can't get it. To, that's Travis Miller, he couldn't get it to fall. Come Turner on this end, lays it up. Pretty shot by Lawhorn. We're all tied up again, seven apiece. 
clock running now, 13, 12, 11. Panthers gonna drive in, good job, 13, he couldn't get it to fall, that was Johnson. Six seconds to play here in the first, Panthers have possession on their end of the court. Johnson's gonna bring it in, trying to get it to the big man down low. Uh, Miller, and they can't get it. Rock's gonna expire, did he get it? And it will, good shot by Bateman. He'll end the first quarter with five points. Turner, nine, Clinch, seven. We'll be back in 60 seconds. For the best barbecue this side of Texas, ramble on over to Barnyard Barbecue in Homerville and Douglas. Whether it's ribs, chicken, sandwiches, tips, or just a barbecue plate that you're looking for, Barnyard Barbecue has it all. Located at 1070 Old Bell Lake Road in Douglas, Georgia and at the Old Jimbo's Log Kitchen Lot in Homerville, Georgia every Thursday, Friday and Saturday from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. Barnyard Barbecue will satisfy your craving for barbecue no matter what you're hungry for. Barnyard Barbecue, Douglas and Homerville, Georgia. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Hanley. We are live here at the Clinch County Middle School where the boys are playing Turner County, the Titans from Turner County, in the middle school final four. The winner will advance to the championship. Good block in there by number 22, that's Shane Burns. He tried to lob one up, Shane wasn't having none of that, he slapped it back out. Turner keeps possession, Mobley with the ball, he'll give it up. Back to Mobley now. Mobley over to Polk. Mobley with it, looking down low. Good steal there by the Panthers. That's number five, Mingo. Malik with the ball. He get it to Posley. Posley back out. Good passing by the Panthers. Johnson with the ball. He'll give it up over to Mingo. Mingo back to Malik. A long three off the back of the rim. Panthers rebounded by Mingo. He can't get it to fall. Posley comes in and gets the rebound. Another long three, off the rim. Panthers can't buy one now. Finally, Turner County will get the rebound. That's Murphy with the rebound. He'll give it back up to Mobley. Mobley will kick it out over to Polk. Polk, long three, good shot by Polk. Two threes tonight for Turner. They're up now, 12 to seven. Good pass from Mingo. We're gonna have a foul though. Foul on number 24. Must be 20. I don't have a 24, so I don't know who that is. Panthers keep possession. Mingo, fade away, can't get it to go. Good job, number 13, Johnson coming up, cleaning it up. 12 to nine now, Panthers cut into the lead. Here comes Turner, number nine, bringing it down, Murphy. Back out to Mobley. Murphy, he'll kick it back to Mobley. He thought about pulling the trigger. We have a foul, let's see, on number 13 for the Panthers, that's Johnson. Coach James got to set him down, that's three on him, I got. Turner keeps possession. 12 to nine, Turner on top. Mobley with the ball, he'll dribble in. Can't get it to go, we got a foul. I don't know what number that foul was, I think it was 22. And that will be Shane Burns and that'll be his first. Gotta put Mobley at the free throw line. First shot on the way. Can't get it to fall, 12 to nine, Turner's out front. Polk and Murphy will check back in now for Turner. Second shot on the way for Turner. In and out, can't get it to fall, out of bounds. Panthers keep possession. Bryant will bring it in for the Panthers. Now he'll get it over to Posley. 
Burns with the ball, back to Posley. Burns looking, he's driving in. We're gonna have a foul on number 24. I do not have his name, but that'll be four, that'll be two fouls on 24. Brian will bring it in for the Panthers. They get it to Burns. Burns kicks it over to Posley. In and out. Panthers can't get one to fall down low. Here comes Turner now. Pope with the ball. He'll drive in. Good pass by Pope. Panthers will steal it. Going to have a foul. I think they're going to call that on Turner. So the Panthers will take over. Got some subs coming in. 12 to nine, Turner leading here in the second quarter. Posley bringing the ball down for the Panthers. They're gonna call a foul on number nine, that's Murphy. Both teams getting close to the bonus, I think. Murphy will sit down and they'll bring Rhodes in. Posley dribbling in. He's going to drive. Good pass over to number five. Too much on it by Mingo. He put a little too much on it over the basket. Panthers keep possession. Brian will bring it in for the Panthers. Looking, looking. He'll get it to Posley. Posley thought about pulling the trigger. He'll Give it over to Mingo. Mingo can't get it to go. Bryant with the ball. He'll throw one up. He can't get it to go. Posley back out. Finally, Malik thought about it. He's going to pull up and drive in. Can't get it to go. Partially blocked by Turner. So here comes the Titan. Kick it off number two. Off the front of the rim. That was Rhodes took the shot. Here comes Bryant for the Panthers. Good steal by number eight. That's Polk. Up, oh, we're gonna have a foul on 22 by the Panthers. That is Burns, that'll be his second. All right, Turner with the ball and the lead. 12 to nine. Murphy with the ball for Turner. He's setting the play up. They're trying to get a good job there by the Panthers, knocking it away. That'll cause them to throw it away down low so the Panthers take over. DeMarco Simon will check in the game now for the Panthers, number three. Brian will bring it in. Here comes Posley for the Panthers. Malik with the ball. he give it back up to Posley. Trying to get it down low. Good pass by Posley. Up and in. Mingo with a basket now. One point game, 12 to 11. Mingo with four points. We got a timeout. They hadn't put the score on the score yet. And I think it's froze up. They're trying to get it adjusted over there. Man, that'll give me time to give a shout out to our sponsors. Let me flip over here. <clears throat> Sophia, give me that page. What are you doing? All right, we have Big Daddy's on Highway 84, Burt CPA, Camping World of Valosta, Big K and Lee Engineering in DuPont, Georgia, Clinch Memorial Family Practice, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, and Clinch Memorial Hospital, Douglas Meadow, Dairy Queen of Homerville, Homerville Jewelers, Huey's One Stop, Lux Brown Insurance, Walker Jones of Waycross, Napa Auto, Savage Turner Law Firm, Dre Snack Shack, and Barnyard Barbecue. We appreciate them being our sponsors. All right, here we go. Turner leading. Well, they got 12 to nine. I don't know what's wrong with the scoreboard. They're trying to hit. Panthers gonna put it up and in. Good job by Posey with the basket. That'll put the Panthers back in front. It should have. They got the score. Messed up or I do. Turner will miss. Oh, good block by Posey down low. Here come the Panthers. Bryant bringing it down. 
He'll give it up, Mingo with the ball, driving in off the backboard, couldn't get it to fall. Malik in there trying to get it. Here comes Turner now, number two, Rhodes will drive in. And they said he walked. There's a turnover. All right, here we go. Turner with the ball. Long shot off the rim. Can't get it to go out of bounds. Turner will keep it. Turner's got two threes. Panthers have none. And according to the scoreboard, it's 12 to 11, Turner County. There's another turnover by Turner. Here come the Panthers. Bryant gonna bring it in. He'll give it to Posey. Here comes Posey. All the way from one end to the other. Good pass, Domingo. We got a foul on number two. That's Rhodes. We're still not at the bonus yet. Malik with the ball now for the Panthers. Good job, Malik gonna throw up a long three, can't get it to go. Out of bounds, so the Panthers will lose it. Here comes Turner County now. They had the lead, 12 to 11. Number eight, that's Polk will bring it in for Turner. Panthers gonna put some pressure on Turner now to get it across. Number one bringing it, that's Bateman. Kick it over. Back out front, good defense by the Panthers. Rose with the ball, he'll drive in, he'll kick it back out to Pope. Back over to Bateman. Got it good, rebound in there by Mingo for the Panthers. He'll get it out, good steal by Turner, that's Bateman with the steal. He's gonna go all the way, throws up a little hook, got his own rebound, up and in. Bateman with seven points tonight so far. 15 to 11, 40 seconds. Clock running here in the first half. Malik with the ball. They get it down to Mingo. Mingo, turn around. Little hook got it to go this time. Six points for Mingo. 14 to, to 13 now. Hang on, let's see what we got here. The coaches. Dane will check in now. Dane Brown, number 14 for the Panthers. That's what I got. Rebound in there by Bryant, up and in. Good shot by Bryant. Panthers up now, 15 to 14. There's Bryant again with the steal, up and in. Eight seconds, 17 14 now. Panthers on top. Turner trying to get down here and stop the bleeding. He'll miss it. Posley with the rebound. And that'll get us to halftime with the Panthers leading Turner County 17 to 14. We're going to take about a 10 minute break and we'll be back. Was the night before Christmas and all through the homes, the children were thrilled by old Walker Jones. Santa will be there, they all would exclaim, with his elves and his reindeer. It had been so ordained. Grab the family and come see Santa Claus, his elves, and real live reindeer. The Grinch will be there, too, when he visits Walker Jones' brand new Chevy store. Tuesday, December 13th, from 4 to 6 p.m. on Memorial Drive in Waycross, and help us fill the sleigh for the Salvation Army's Angel Tree from the Walker Jones family to Yours. Merry Christmas. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Enjoy the Pizza Inn All Day Buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn in Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. 
Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the USA reality. Experience the freedom that comes with the purchase of an RV from Camping World of Valosta. Whether it is a purchase of an RV, maintenance, service, or camping supplies, Camping World of Valosta can meet all of your RV needs. So don't put your dreams off another day. As part of our commitment to convenient health care and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912 912- 470-2359 to learn more. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food including the perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll. Napa Auto Parts 255 South Church Street, Homerville, Georgia is your one stop for all auto, truck parts, tools, equipment, and accessories. Napa Auto Parts has been a name you can trust in Homerville for many years. If Napa does not have the item you need in stock, the friendly, knowledgeable, and efficient personnel at Napa Auto Parts will have it for you the next day. Open at 7 a.m. Monday through Friday and 8 a.m. on Saturday, Napa Auto Parts in Homerville is a name you can trust. Napa Auto Parts in Homerville. From our swing bed service to our primary care practice, and now our new retail pharmacy, Clinch Memorial Hospital is equipped to provide our community the best care right here at home. Dr. Angkor is Clinch Memorial's physician and offers quality care at Clinch Family Practice, where our community can also enjoy spa services. At Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, patients can fulfill their prescriptions conveniently with our curbside pickup services. We also provide the COVID vaccine. Give us a call at 912 912- 470-2359 to schedule yours today. This is Alan Hanley, and I want to tell you about Dre's Snack Shack. Dre specializes in chicken wings, barbecue, sausage, hot dogs, hamburgers, salads, and a variety of other mouth-watering menu items. So y'all come on down and see Dre at Dre's Snack Shack. He can handle all your catering needs also. The good thing is he stays open late at night after the game. So please come in and see Dre at Dre Snack Chat. For the best pizza and wings in town any day of the week, check out Huey's One Stop in Homerville. Drop by, fuel up, and let Mr. Nick Patel and staff serve you some mouth-watering pizza and wings that you won't soon forget. Or just take that favorite pizza and box of wings home. Call 912-487-2338 to order your pizza and wings every Friday night after the game. Huey's One Stop, 193 Church Street, Homerville. Homerville Jewelers in Homerville is your headquarters for bridal and baby registry. Our newly remodeled location has that special gift for the bride and groom or that perfect gift for the new baby. Homerville Jewelers has the gifts that are suited for any special occasion, whatever it might be. Homerville Jewelers can perform jewelry repairs and offers a variety of diamonds, gold, sterling silver, watches, and necklaces. No need to shop out of town. Homerville Jewelers can supply all your gift and jewelry needs. Let Kathy Townsend and staff serve you at Homerville Jewelers, East Dame Avenue, Homerville. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas has the cheapest prices in South Georgia. 
and a huge inventory of new and used gas and electric golf carts and off-road vehicles. Mike's also has parts and accessories and proudly serves customers across the states of Georgia, Florida, and Alabama. Whether you stop into our store or shop with us online, we have everything you need for Can-Am, EasyGo, Club Car, and Yamaha. 0% financing available for qualified customers. Mike's Golf Carts and Power Sports in Douglas, Georgia. Dairy Queen is a proud part of our local communities and is cheering our sports teams on to championship seasons. Drop by before and after the game to say hello to Mr. Ash and his entire crew and enjoy the full Dairy Queen menu including our famous grilled burgers, artisan style sandwiches, and chicken strips. Cool off with our renowned smoothies, slushies, malts, and iced coffees. Try our fabulous desserts and take an ice cream cake home for that special occasion or just to treat the family. Dine in or take out at Dairy Queen locations in Homerville, Blackshire, Folkestone, and Fernandina Beach. See you at the DQ. Lee Engineering and Construction Company in DuPont, Georgia has been a part of the community since 1935 and is proud to support Clinch County Athletics. The prayer of the entire Lee Engineering family is that our Lord and Savior will richly bless our schools, community, and nation. At Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing, we only use top quality steel and roofing. And with our on-staff custom designer, we can customize your building to best suit your needs. From large commercial, agriculture, or just a place to store your stuff. And it comes with a written 40-year warranty that we'll put in your hand. It's not just quality we stand behind, but we stand on. Call today for a free quote. Douglas Metal and Steel Manufacturing. We are steel number one. Lutz, Brown, Piegler, and Manley Insurance Agency is locally owned and has been a part of the Homerville, Clinch County community for many years. We make it a priority to know our clients on a personal basis and take pride in customizing insurance coverage for the particular needs of each customer. We offer all lines of insurance including auto, home, business, life insurance, annuities, and bonds. Lutz, Brown, Piegler, and Manley Insurance Agency, East Dame Avenue, Home. Clinch Memorial Family Practice is growing to better meet the needs of our community. Located in the heart of Homerville, we're convenient for so many of you from Homerville to Lakeland, Statenville, and Pearson. We're a qualified team to take care of you and your family. In addition to primary care, we are a medical spa. We provide a variety of massage therapy and aesthetic services. From sick visits to deep tissue massages and facials, Clinch Family Practice is here to serve you. All right, good evening, everybody. Welcome back to Creek Box. I need to correct some things. I had the roster, and I had as they see. What's up, buddy? Uh, Simon is number two, and Malik is number three. All right, so I'm going to go through with some of the points now for the Panthers. I apologize. We have Bryant with four points. Uh, Simon with three points. Mingo with six points. Posley with two Johnson with two, and Shane Burns with two points for the Panthers. Uh, the big score for Turner County is Bateman with seven points, Sears with two points, Lawhorn with two, and Polk with three points. We got a great game here. Panthers lead 17 to 14. We're getting ready to start the second half. Now, I appreciate that. Brianna sent me that text, and I just seen it. Now, I apologize. Uh, we got it straight. Maybe we won't mess up no more. All right, here come the Panthers. Posley with the ball. He's going to get it down low to Mingo. Good job by number four for Turner. He's going to knock it out. That was Sears. Here come the Titans down here. He's going to lay it up. Can't get it. Mingo with the rebound. Long pass to Simon. Simon trying to lay it up. Can't get it. Malik with the rebound, but he'll lose it. So here comes Turner now. Turner kicks it out. Number four is going to take a long three and got it to fall. That's Sears with a three point. That's their third one tonight. We're all tied up 17 apiece here in the third quarter. 
Long shot by the Panthers. He can't get it to go. That was Simon. Out of bounds. Panthers keep possession. These two teams are about as even as you can get. Panthers with the ball. Posley, he's going to get it in. Down low to number three, Malik. Turn around. He can't get it to go in. A rebound, number four, Sears. He'll give it up to Rhodes. Rhodes turning in. He's going to throw it up from the free throw line and got it. Good shot by Rhodes. 19-17 now. Turner County on top of Clinton County. Simon driving in. It wrapped in, went in, and come out. Here comes Bateman with the ball for Turner. We're going to have a foul. No, nope, they said he traveled. He'll turn it over. Shane Burns will check back in for the Panthers. Bryant's going to bring it in. He'll give it up to Posley. Here come the Panthers now. 19-17, Turner County on top. The winner will advance to the championship Saturday at 2. Simon, long three, can't get it to go. Burns up high with the rebound. He can't get it to go. Jump ball, who has the possession, Turner does. The Turner County will take over. Hanson's in a press now, it looks like. Oh, man. Simon will come over. He's going to make a foul. That'll be his first one, though. Good job, Posley tipped it away. Almost got a steal, good pass. Turner got, oh, that's a good block down there by the Panthers. Bryant got a piece of it. Good defense by the Panthers. Number four was taking the shot, that was Sears. Bryant got up high and knocked it away. Here comes Posley now, bringing it down for the Panthers. He'll give it up to number two, that's Simon. Simon driving in, throws it up. He's going to draw a foul. They're going to call that on number two. That's Rhodes, and that'll be his third foul. That'll put Simon at the free throw line. He has three points tonight for the Panthers. 1917, Turner County on top. No, nope, they said it's not a shooting foul. Number four for the Panthers will check in now. That's Jake King. Posley bringing it in. He'll get it down to Mingo. Mingo will miss it. Almost got his own rebound. Good pass, Turner County, from one end to the other. That was number one, Bateman with the basket. 21-17 now, Turner County up by four. Panthers will throw it away. Another Panther turnover. 3.46 to play in the third, 21-17. Here comes Turner now. Back into number one, Bateman with the ball. He'll kick it over to number four. We're going to have a foul on Turner, so that'll be a turnover. Trying to set a screen for a blocking foul. All right, here comes Posley and the Panthers. Back down the court. Good job, Simon with it. He's going to give it to King. King trying to get it inside Domingo. Turner will kick it out of bounds. Panthers keep possession. They get it to King. King dribbling, looking. Got it to Posley. Posley driving. He'll kick it out to Mingo. Mingo throwing up, can't get it to fall. Here comes Turner now. Sears with the ball. Long pass. He's going to overthrow Lawhorn. That'll be a turnover. The Panthers are. Get the possession now. Number nine will check in. That's Murphy for Turner. Here comes Posley bringing it back down. 3-12, 3-11 to play in the third. 21-17, Turner County on top of the Panthers. Posley driving in, can't get it to fall. Turner with the rebound. Here come the Titans now. Bateman with the ball. He'll pass it way out to number six for three. He'll miss it. 
Another offensive rebound up and in. Number four, Seared with the basket. Seared with seven points now. 23-17, Turner on top. Biggest lead of the night for the Titans. They get it to Burns. Burns off the backboard. He'll draw the foul. That'll put Burns at the free throw line. Panthers need to make these count. First shot on the way for Burns, and he got it. Good shot, three points for Shane tonight. 23-18. Burns, second shot on the way. Got it, good shot by Shane, he'll make both of them. 23-19 now, here comes Turner, long pass. He got it over to number one, Bateman. Bateman will kick it out over to King. Oh, and that will be a walk. That was Lawhorn trying to drive to the basket. He took too many steps. Here come the Panthers now. Johnson bringing it down for the Panthers. He's been in foul trouble. He's got three fouls. They get it to King. King thought about it. He's going to step, throws it up, can't get it to fall. Panthers got the rebound. Burns had it. He'll miss it. Here come Turner now. Bateman with the ball. He'll kick it out to Lawhorn. Lawhorn can't get it to go. Another offensive rebound. They'll have a foul. Let's see if that one's on. For number four, King. That'll be his first. That's going to put Walker at the free throw line for Turner. 23-19, Turner on top. 152 to play in the third. First shot on the way, got it off the backboard. That'll be Walker's first basket tonight. 24-19. Second free throw on the way. Off the back of the rim, can't get it to fall. Good rebound in there by Johnson for the Panthers. Here comes Clint, they give it to Simon. Simon, he get it down to Mingo. Back out to Johnson, long three, got it this time. Good shot by Johnson with the three-pointer. He's got five tonight. There's a steal by the Panthers. He'll lay it up and in again. Johnson, back-to-back -back baskets now. Panthers were all tied up 24 apiece, and there's another turnover. 125 to play. Johnson's hit five points in a row. King will take a seat, and Bryant will come back in the game for the Panthers. They get it to Burns. Burns, turn around. He's going to throw it off the backboard. Can't get it to fall. Here comes Turner now. Clock running, 115 to play in the third. Turner is going to be tipped out. Simon had it. Turner will knock it out of bounds. So the Panthers will have possession. All right, here comes Johnson bringing it down for the Panthers. Look, and he'll pull up. Thought about shooting another three. He'll give it up to Bryant. Drives in. He can't get it, but he'll draw the foul. Good move by Bryant. Right, first shot on the way. In and out, it wrapped around the rim and come out. Second free throw on the way. We're tied up, Panthers trying to take the lead back. Good rebound down low. Shane had it. He'll tip it away at it twice. Wide open on the other end, here comes Turner. He'll lay it up and in. Good shot by Bateman. 11 points for Bateman and they get a timeout. Turner lead 26-24, we'll take a break. We'll be back in 30 seconds. 
For the best barbecue this side of Texas, ramble on over to Barnyard Barbecue in Homerville and Douglas. Whether it's ribs, chicken, sandwiches, tips, or just a barbecue plate that you're looking for, Barnyard Barbecue has it all. Located at 1070 Old Bell Lake Road in Douglas, Georgia and at the Old Jimbo's Log Kitchen Lot in Homerville, Georgia every Thursday, Friday and Saturday from 11 a.m. until 7 p.m. Barnyard Barbecue will satisfy your craving for barbecue no matter what you're hungry for. Barnyard Barbecue, Douglas and Homerville, Georgia. Twas the night before Christmas and all through the homes, the children were thrilled by old Walker Jones. Santa will be there, they all would exclaim, with his elves and his reindeer. It had been so ordained. Grab the family and come see Santa Claus, his elves, and real live reindeer. The Grinch will be there too when he visits Walker Jones. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Henley. Here we go, the last 45 seconds of the third. Panthers trail by two, 26-24. Bryant with the ball. He's going to throw up a little hook. It's going to be short. Oh, Shane had it. Can't get it to fall. Oh, yep, there's going to be a turnover. At number nine, Murphy stretched out to get it. Couldn't control his feet. Took an extra step. Here come the Panthers, 32 seconds, clock running now here in the third. 26-24, Turner up by two. Johnson drives in, can't get it to go. This time, number three will put it up and in, that's Malik. We're all tied up, 26 apiece. Number one with a foul, that's gonna be Bryant, that'll be his first. 18 seconds to play here in the third. Burns will take a seat, he'll take a break, and Travis Miller will come in for the Panthers, number 23. Simon all over him, trying to get him. They finally get it over half court. Here comes Turner, good pass down low. Burns there, oh! Simon tried to tip it out to half court. Three seconds, one second. That's gonna be it, and that's it. After three quarters, we are all tied up 26 apiece. We're going to take a 60-second break. We'll be back. Enjoy the Pizza Inn all-day buffet with more than 40 items featuring salads, pasta, desserts, and pizzas located at 501 South City Boulevard in Waycross. Whether you want to dine in or take out, the Pizza Inn in Waycross is the place to go for wonderful pizza and salad bar. Call 912-809-2411 for takeout orders or drop by for a grand dining experience. The Pizza Inn, Waycross, Georgia. Need a break? Need some quality family time? Get over to Camping World of Valosta right now. Camping World of Valosta can put you in an RV for as little as $5 per day. Make your dreams of camping with your family or a road trip across the U.S. All right, here we go, everybody. Welcome back to Creek Box TV. Panthers with the ball, trying to take the lead back. And the turnover by Turner. Both teams have kind of had butterfingers tonight. Winner will advance to the championship Saturday at 2. If the Panthers win, it'll be here in Clinch County at the high school. 26-26. Panthers undefeated. There's a long three. Can't get it to fall. Rebound, got it passed down low to, to uh, Malik, and Malik will put it in. Panthers finally take the lead back, 28-26. There's another Turner turnover. Coach Johnson over there coaching them up from Turner County. All right, here come the Panthers trying to add to the lead. They get it to Bryant. Bryant going to lay it up off his fingertips. Good rebound by 23 down low. He can't get it to fall, Turner with the rebound. Miller tried to get it and lay it in there. Number four will drive in, a right-handed layup. Good job by Sears with the basket. Sears with nine points for Turner tonight. We're tied back up, 28 apiece. Panthers get it, the Burns down low, off the backboard, let's see, we got a foul. Oh, that was Miller down low, excuse me. Man, he made it too, but there was a foul away from the basket. Mingo will check back in now, and Miller will take a seat. 
Johnson will bring it in for the Panthers. Looking, looking, they got to get it in. He'll throw it up, Domingo, he'll jump up and get it. They kick it over to Johnson, long three, in and out. Mingo with the rebound, he'll throw it up, can't get it to fall. Panthers wanted a foul. Oh, Simon almost with the steal. We're gonna have a foul and they're gonna call that on Simon and that'll be his second. 28-28, we're tied up. Turner County with the ball, 4.56 to play in the game. Turner has hit one, two, three threes tonight. Panthers have hit one. Rhodes with the ball for Turner. He'll kick it over to Bateman. Back to Rhodes. Rhodes dribbling, looking for some help. Panthers tipping it around. We got a jump ball. Panthers should have possession. No, they give it to Turner. Turner with the possession. Kicks it in the road. Rose turn around. Jumper got it to fall. Oh, that was Bateman. Good shot by Bateman. 30-28. Turner County on top. They get it to Mingo down low. Panthers can't buy it down low. Good shot. Malik got it. Put the rebound up and in. 30-30. Mingo almost with a steal. Oh, thought he traveled. We called a foul, let's see. They're gonna call a foul on number four, Turner Sears, that'll be in second. We are tied up 30 to 30, 406 to play in the game. Johnson bringing it down. Turner's in a man-to-man -man now all over the court. Johnson will drive in and kick it down to Mingo. Mingo can't get it to go. He got his own rebound. Turned around trying to get it to go again. Can't get it. Panthers stone cold down low trying to get a shot off. Here comes Turner County. Rhodes with the ball. He'll give it back up to Bateman. Bateman back over to Lawhorn. Raw Horn, they're gonna call a foul on number two. That's Simon, that'll be foul number three on Simon. Rhodes will bring it in for Turner. They get it over to number five, Law Horn. Law Horn driving to the basket. He'll throw it up, can't get it to go. Bryant with the rebound, he'll get it over to Johnson. Johnson gonna throw up a three off the back of the rim. Panthers turn it over, here comes Turner. We're still tied, 30 to 30. Good pass down low by Turner. They're gonna throw up a three, can't get it to go. Mingo with the rebound. He'll give it up to Malik. Malik all the way to the basket, up and in. Good shot by Malik. Eight points for Malik tonight. Panthers back on top, 32 to 30. Turner wants a timeout. With that, we'll take a 30 second timeout. We'll be back. As part of our commitment to convenient healthcare and the highest quality in pharmacy services, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy offers three convenient ways for you to get your prescriptions. We offer an easy walk-in location near the ER entrance. Our pharmacist is on site, ready to help if you have any questions. With our curbside pickup options, we will bring the prescriptions to your car. Just call ahead. We also offer a delivery service for prescriptions for patients in Clinch County. Make the change today. Call 912-470-2359 to learn more. All right, everybody. Welcome back to Creekbox TV. I'm Alan Henley. Got my buddy Daniel Munoz over here running the camera and Sophia Maria over here eating popcorn. <laughs> you don't need all your popcorn. We have got a great game tonight here at the middle school. The final four, the winner will advance. Clinch 32, Turner County 30. Turner County with the ball. Panthers led seven to nothing early, but it's been all Turner since then and the Panthers have fought back. Taking lead, there's another turnover. Panthers have it. 
Bryant with the ball. He's going to throw it up. Let's see. No basket. Let's see. We got a foul, I guess, on number four. Four. That's Sears. That'll be his third. Sears tonight for Turner has four, seven, nine points. And that is number five, and that's what Sears will foul out. Man, that's gonna be a huge, he's got nine points. A third of the points for Turner tonight. Johnson with the ball. Looking one way, he's gonna drive to the basket. He lost it, he kicked it out to Mingo. Mingo down to, good pass to Mingo to Malik down low, 10 points for Malik tonight. Oh, there's a collision. We got a foul, Mingo ran in to Bateman. Mingo, that'll be his first foul. Panthers, a little bit of breathing room, 34-30, 2.35 to play in the game. Rhodes will bring it in. Bateman's gonna bring it down for Turner. They need a basket here. Bateman all the way to the basket. Mingo with a big rebound. He'll give it out to Bryant. Here comes Bryant over to Johnson. Johnson looking for the Panthers. He finds Mingo down low. He's going to throw it up. Can't get it to go, but he'll draw a foul. The foul will be on number one. That's Bateman. That'll be his first. It'll be a one and one for Mingo. Thirty-four thirty. Panthers on top. Two nineteen to play. First shot on the way. Got it, good shot by Mingo. Seven points tonight for Mingo. 35-30 now, Panthers up. Full house here at the middle school, nowhere else to sit. Second shot on the way. Off the back of the rim. Oh, they're gonna call a foul on Bryant. That'll be his second. Turner will bring it in now. Rhodes will bring it in for Turner. Panthers jump into a man to man. There's another steal. Bryant has it. He's going to lay it up. He's going to call a foul. That's going to go against Turner. Panthers keep possession. Good steal by Bryant. Bryant, he'll get it down low. Good shot there, Malik with the basket. 12 points for Malik now, 37-30. There's a steal by Simon. Simon all the way, throw it up, can't get it to fall. Bryant with the rebound. Over to Johnson, Johnson's gonna drive in. Bounce pass out to Simon. Oh, off the back of the rim. Mingo with the rebound, up and in. Panthers starting to pull away a little bit now, 39-30. That press has got them all shook up. Coach James jumped in that press and the Panthers have went on a nine to nothing run now. 139 to play in the game. Big possession for Turner, they need a basket now. They get it in, they finally get it in. He's gonna take it, oh, he took an extra step. That was Mobley. He'll turn it over so the Panthers have the ball. 137 to play in the game. Coach James wants a timeout. He's gonna talk to the Panther players. With that, we'll take one too. We'll be back in 30 seconds. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill, located at 31 East Dame Avenue, Homerville, has the best food and atmosphere anywhere around. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill has a great lunch and dinner menu with a wide variety of your favorite food including that perfectly grilled steak, wraps, sandwiches, chicken and salads. Big Daddy's in Homerville also has your favorite drink to go with your meal. Drop by Big Daddy's in Homerville, you won't be disappointed. Big Daddy's Bar and Grill on 84 in Homerville for the best food and drinks around.
All right, everybody, welcome back to Creek Box TV. I'm Alan Hanley. Got my buddy Daniel Munoz up top. We are here at the middle school gym, and the Panthers lead 39 to 30. Here come the Panthers. Johnson drives, and it'll roll in. Good shot by Johnson. Panther Johnson will steal it again. He'll draw a foul. Johnson has four, seven, nine points tonight for the Panthers. He'll go to the free throw line, 126 to play in the game. Panthers on top by 11, 41 to 30. Turner County's running out of gas down here at the end. They led most of the game. Panthers played sloppy and Turner was able to lead. And, but the Panthers, when they get ready to play, man, they'll steal it and they'll score six, eight points. Boom, in a blink of an eye. First shot up by Johnson, up and in. 10 points for him tonight. 42 to 30 now. Second free throw on the way, in and out. Can't get it to go, but Johnson got the rebound. Mingo will tip it over to him. Oh, Malik with the ball, he'll draw a foul. Foul on number nine, that's Murphy. That'll be his second. Malik at the foul, at the free throw line now. Malik taking his time, first shot on the way in and out. 122 to play, 42 to 30. Panthers trying to hold, hold on and play for the middle school championship this Saturday at two o'clock in Homerville at the high school. Second shot on the way, got it. Good shot by Malik. Malik with 13 points tonight. Number 11 with the ball. He can't, he'll lose it out of bounds. That was Tillman. They're gonna call a foul on the Panthers, I think. Number two, they called that on Simon. Turner County with it. He's gonna drive in, throw it up, can't get it to go. One had it, can't get it to go. On the back, can't get it to go. That's Mobley. 102 to play, 43 to 30. Panthers on top. Panthers will remain undefeated. Through the 11 0 long pass. Good job. Mingo will lay it up and in. 11 points for Mingo tonight. 45 30, under a minute to play in the game. Mobley dribbling around, they're gonna call a foul on Mingo for the Panthers. That is Mingo, that's his third. Now put them in the bonus. So that will put Mobley at the free throw line. Panthers are on a 15 to nothing run here. First shot on the way for Mobley from Turner. Can't get it to go. Good rebound down low, but Mingo will slap it out of there. Out with Rhodes with the rebound for Turner. Come to Panthers. Simon going throw it to Mingo under the basket. Up and in. Looks like a sewing machine. Mingo with another basket. 13 for him tonight. 47 to 30. Remind everybody, if you're not doing nothing Saturday, please go out to the high school and watch the middle school championship. We don't know who they're gonna be playing on the other side yet. Bateman at the free throw line for Turner. His first shot, in and out. Panthers have outscored Turner 17 to nothing. Here the last four minutes. Turner hasn't made a basket in four minutes. They just went stone cold. Here comes Bryant. Bryant will lose the ball. Murphy with it. Mobley with it. Mobley, good bounce. Pass over to number five, and he can't get it to go in. Wide open. It's been that kind of fourth quarter for Turner. Seven seconds, six seconds. 
three seconds, two seconds, and that's gonna do it. The Prince County Middle School will advance to the championship Saturday at two o'clock, 47 to 30. We're gonna step back and take a break, run through some ads, and we'll be back in just a second. At Burt CPAs, helping small businesses with their accounting needs is our business. We have offices in Homerville, Waycross, Alma, and Baxley. Burt's professionals are ready to serve you no matter your location. We are your team for accounting, bookkeeping, tax, and financial advice. In Homerville, call firm partner Adam Toll. Napa Auto Parts 255 South Church Street, Homerville, Georgia is your one stop for all auto, truck parts, tools, equipment, and accessories. Napa Auto Parts has been a name you can trust in Homerville for many years. If Napa does not have the item you need in stock, the friendly, knowledgeable, and efficient personnel at Napa Auto Parts will have it for you the next day. Open at 7 a.m. Monday through Friday and 8 a.m. on Saturday, Napa Auto Parts in Homerville is a name you can trust. Napa Auto Parts in Home. All right, everybody, welcome back. Look at here's Uncle Charles. Hey, Daniel, you got Charles on TV right there. All right, everybody, welcome back to Creekbox TV. The Panthers get the win 47 to 30. They'll advance to the championship Saturday. I'm going to give a shout out before we get out of here to our uh, sponsors. We have Big Daddies on 84, Burt, CPA, Camping World of Alasta, Big K, and Lee Engineering. Clinch Memorial Family Practice, Clinch Memorial Pharmacy, and Clinch Memorial Hospital. Douglas Meadow, Dairy Queen of Homerville, Homerville Jewelers, Huey's One Stop, Lutz Brown Insurance, Walker Jones of Waycross, Napa Auto, Savage Turner Law Firm out of Savannah, Georgia, Dre Snack Shack, and Barnyard Barbecue. They're our sponsors. Man, once again, y'all stay in touch. Me and Daniel, I'll put it on Facebook when we're going to come back and, uh, Bring some more basketball for the high school. Probably be after the first of the year. Uh, they got a tournament or two for Christmas they're gonna play in way off. Uh, we won't get them, but starting in January, we'll get them all down the line then. Uh, I appreciate y'all tuning in, and I'm gonna get out of here just like Mr. Barron said. Tell someone about Jesus. God bless you, happy holidays, and we'll see you next time on Creek Box.